What we see in trends is the human effort to reconcile change as it's coming up from the bottom with our values and worldview. I'm a futurist, so what that means is that I look at long-term trends, uh, global change, and its impact on business and society. When change and certain capabilities start to emerge, there's no holding it back. It will come to pass. It's just a matter of when. And the limiting factor is us. And it takes us some time to make sense of it. If we understand how change occurs, then we can begin to see what's affecting markets. And for marketers, that's critical. You need to know and be able to anticipate how uh, customers are going to be, what they're going to be wanting, and how they're going to want it delivered. And it all ties together. This is the Chinese coming into Africa and saying, we're going to extend the cables from France along the coast here so that we can start to have build inroads for electricity and more importantly for cable connectivity and internet. What's possible when you electrify and connect people with mobile and computers and information networks? That's a big deal. Part of it is to ask why is that? Why do we continue in many ways to choose crises and the what I have determined is that we know better, we don't do better, what's missing? The answer being we need to know how to know better. Today, as you look ahead, there's going to be a lot of emphasis on doing, tactics. I want you to think about in the background the four forces. I want you to think about what it is that you bring back, but also how you bring it back. So that's your challenge, is to think about the future that you're building, your challenge to leave here today with something that you can really own and understand in a new framework that adds a lot more value to who you are and your clients. First of all, it's impressive to see the audience that came out today. The keynote this morning was fantastic, uh, really eye-opening stuff, and it was a pile of fun.